Hi everyone, I'm Tom and today I'm going to be playing, or hopefully we are going to be playing Welcome to New Las Vegas, which is a sequel to Welcome to, that is a fantastic roll and write, flip and fill game from a few years ago that is absolutely fantastic. New Las Vegas obviously transports the setting a little bit rather than just building some suburbs, we're building a great big Vegasy city, but with that comes a lot of extra stuff. So I would strongly recommend, as, as the rulebook does, if you are completely new to Welcome To, I did do a playthrough for that original game that you could also play along with. Now with this playthrough, there is kind of more competition between the players. Not only are we racing for projects, but we are also racing to complete avenues. They are columns on our player sheets. And at the time of recording, I wasn't able to find a link for the score sheet anywhere either. But that being said, you are more than welcome to play along if you would like to. So there is a last part of setup that we need to do. This is going to come into effect at the end of the game. We have to decide whether we are taking a loan out in the corner over here. And basically, if you are, you circle the loan. If you are being strict and you're not taking a loan, you circle the other one. Basically, you can rack up debts in this game. If the majority of players decided to take loans out at the start of the game, they're less likely to be punished by those debts at the end of the game. Obviously, in a two-player game, it's a kind of golden ball situation. If both players go for generosity, we'll get a load of stuff. But if even one of us doesn't, then we'll be uh, getting the stingier option. But you, you always get something. So Marty has chosen his in secret, and we'll fold it over. And, hmm... Do I want to be? I want to be generous. I am going to fold that over too. And we reveal at the end of the game. So, let's get into the actual playing of it. Just like Welcome To, we have three stacks of cards. Just the whole deck is shuffled and split as evenly as possible. So I think we are now ready. So we, I don't know why I had these face down. It doesn't matter what these numbers are because they're going to get flipped over straight away. <laughs> we flip over a card from each deck. Uh, so we basically get to designate a casino. We have to put a number onto our sheets somewhere. The numbers are from 1 to 15, and the numbers in the middle are much more likely. There are only three 15s in the deck, for example. But you pick a number effect combination. So as well as letting you write a 15 onto your sheet, it's also going to give you the limousine action. You have to open the casino. Performing the effect is optional. There are also bonuses as well. So there are three different bonuses we can use. We can either adjust a number up or down by one or two. We can choose the effect rather than the designated one that we picked. Or we can have a bonus casino. And this is like the, the BIS bonus from Welcome To, where it allows you to duplicate a number. Now, to get these actions, we have one bonus at the start of the game. You basically circle one of these sections. You see these crosses are sectioned off. Using a section of crossed off circles is using a bonus up. If you use the first two options, you can scribble out the debt. It doesn't matter. But if you chose to duplicate a casino, that does incur a debt and you circle it instead. As it stands though, let's have a look at what we've got. So I could do... Casino or crane. Crane is to do with opening casinos. You can see there are these cranes dotted about our player sheets. You can't put a number in a space with a crane. It's not been built yet. This is uh, building it. We are shooting for projects as well, or projects if you like. Uh, we need to, to fulfill each of these objectives. The first player to do it gets the most points, then everybody else gets the lower number of points. This objective wants the hotels for 1st and 11th Avenue to be completed. You get a hotel when you have filled in the numbers on each of those columns. For the yellow objective, you need to have completed all of your cranes. So done all of the cranes and built the casinos. Put a number in those spaces. And for the purple objective, we want series of odd-numbered casinos. You will be rewarded in this game for having uh, longer and longer series of odd or even casinos. I think I'm going to go for 15 and limo because that's kind of easy to just put at the very end of a row, isn't it? So which one would I like? I can put them anywhere I like. The rule is kind of the same number in the same row unless you use the extended casino bonus, which duplicates a number, so it has to be the same. Numbers have to go in ascending order, although you can leave gaps, as many gaps as you like. Yeah, I'm just going to, I'm just going to start with this one because this one uh, finishes at the end. I'm just going to go 15 there. And so the limousine action. You see the limo park here at the airport. This is taking a tour around our city. You basically start from this traffic light and go to a lamppost somewhere. 
a lot of the casinos will have bonuses outside for people to see. It's either these fountains, these VIP areas, or this cash here, mafia money. <laughs> when you go past them, you circle the bonuses, and if uh, the casino has been opened, you'll get points for every one of those you drove past at the end of the game. Now, your limousine route needs to be finished, it needs to go back to the traffic lights by the very end. If you haven't done that, for every limo action you would have needed to take to get you back to the starting point, you'll lose 10 points. Now, that the bonuses and the penalties can be changed throughout the game. We'll see that as we go on. But I think I'm going to go big. I'm going to go all limos all the time. I'm going to go right up here. So I have found this fountain. If I can put a number in there by the end of the game, that's going to earn me three points right now, maybe up to seven points for every one of those that I go past. Marty is going to go for something different. He's going to go smack dab in the middle here with a nine without thinking about it too much. And he is going to go for a crane because, yeah, to, to do either of these columns and to get all of the cranes, you need to have built them. So the crane action, basically scribble out a crane and circle the debt. If that casino isn't opened, so if it hasn't got a number in it by the end of the game, that incurs a debt. If we do open the casino, though, we can scribble out that debt. So that is the first turn, and we've seen two of the many actions. Go on to the next turn. Oh, I'm going to be doing the cards upside down the whole time, aren't I? We'll sort that out. So we have seven crane, four crane, eight limo. So we know what I'm going to take. I'm definitely going to go for... Hmm, where would I like it to be? I'm going to go for eight. I think I'm going to go for eight here. And limo... I'm going to keep my limo journey going. I've gone past some money there, which will cancel out a debt, basically, at the end of the game. And Marty can go for, you know, sequences of odd numbers. This is part of scoring at the end of the game. You get a point for every casino in your longest series of odd or even for each street, and also a bonus if you had the longest of each street. So Marty's working towards that, and as well as that, we've got this project that wants us to have series of four odd numbered casinos and it can be one great big series of eight if you do that but it can be four on separate streets or the same streets they don't have to be linked so marty's gonna go for this seven stick it right next to his nine and he's got another crane action uh why not he'll go for maybe he'll try and fill in these uh, columns first and get these hotels next turn now how is it so i can have them the right way around oh, i can't do it can i <laughs> just flip the guard around uh, so we have five crane that we've seen, or we have eight or ten inauguration. Now, inauguration basically gives you a cross on this inauguration track. We're basically helping the mayor's inauguration. He will give us rewards. He'll give us bonuses if we can help him along in this. It's one of the triggers for the end of the game, someone getting to the end of this track. Now, what Marty wishes he'd done is uh, use this crane here, because a five would go perfectly here. But unfortunately, the effect comes after you have filled the number in. Now, you can put a five here, and if you never do this crane, if you never build this casino, it does not interrupt your streak, basically. But as soon as you build the casino, it does get in the way. You can see, by the way, what the next effect is going to be next turn, but you don't know which number it's going to apply to. Because ideally, you want the show bonus for when you're writing in these spaces. I'm just thinking if I continue my 10 series here. I think I'm going to go for a crane. I'm going to put a five there. Seems like a good place for a five. And I'm going to do a crane here. If I want to do this column, I'm going to have to do it sooner or later. Marty's going to do that, but he's going to go up here, I think. Now, up top, we have... Where's he going to put it? I'm going to put it there. It might be hard to fill up on this section. Now, the top row has these golf courses. The first number that you put in this row, you circle that golf course. Par three shows you on your score sheet how many points that's worth. That's worth... An extra point that uh, golf course in the future on this top row you need to build adjacent if you don't build adjacent if he was to put a number in here for example he would cross off all of his golf courses in that direction these would still be okay providing you build adjacent if he misses one he would have to scribble out all of these golf courses and miss out on all of those lovely bonus points so that's what he's gone for and he gets another crane he's gonna do it here in case another five comes out <laughs> he can slot it in there Okay, that's uh, that turn done. So we've got nine show, nine show, eight limo. I think 
I'm going to go for nine here. Oh, but show is right there. You want you want show to be in a show section, really? Well, you don't have to go for that. I'm going to go for nine here, hoping that seven comes in later. And I'm just not doing the effect because it has to be in a show space. Marty is set up perfectly for it, though, on the other hand. Uh, he can circle the star. And he has to choose one of these show columns. Basically, this one is worth more points, but it's more likely you'll get debts. He's going to start in this one. He's going to try and go for the more points. So you cross off the first space of that column. He's going to get three points now at the end of the game. But he circles these two debts. If he crosses off these two spaces by doing loads of shows, he doesn't get those debts. But uh, yeah, they're going to be there if he doesn't get that far down. Okay, so that's, uh, that's that round. We've got, what have we got here? Six, improvement, 10 show, four show. I could go 10 show here, but I could also go, I'm gonna go for 10 show. I don't think I'm gonna do it that much though. I'm gonna go in the less risky column. Marty is gonna use a bonus. He is gonna adjust. So he's gonna do that to show that he's used those up. There is a majority at the end of the game for having the most unused crosses at the end. That's what this is. 10 points for the most. Five second place, two for third place. And the person with the fewest gets a debt. Uh, but he's going to adjust this show to be an 11 because he's got a space for it right here and it keeps his series going. He's going to keep going in his same column and we move on to the next one. What have we got? 11 show... 11 limo, 7 show. We have an 11 show right there. Oh, 11 limo. If I'm going to be doing this big thing, I'm going to do... Oh, yes, it's on a show space. I've got to do 11 show. Yeah, 11 show. Keep going down there. Marty hasn't done any limo yet. Would 7 show fit in somewhere? He could just... Oh, no, he has given up on the golf courses. He didn't mean to do that. He's just too excited by the show, but he's given up on all those golf courses. Oh, no, that's probably a bad move. But he can fill in this however he likes now. He's just going to do seven to keep the series going and uh, forego the effect. So what have we got here? Someone needs to do an improvement, don't we? So I can talk about that. Got five improvement, eight limo, ten crane. Marty is going to go for five improvement. There is his first series of four odd numbers. So improvements, you see all these yellow boxes on here. Improvement lets you cross off the top yellow box in any of these columns to make things worth more points. I think Marty is not going to be doing it for golf courses. He thinks he's going to come first on these uh, long, odd or even series in the streets. He's going to try and improve his bonus. So for every street he's got the longest series on, he's going to get six points rather than four. I think I'm going to go for limo, but I'm going to change that to a seven. So I've got uh, that series as well. I'm going to keep going along the top. I've got that fountain there as long as I put some numbers in here, which I haven't so far. But hey, it's going to happen. Uh, so what have we got here? 13 limo, 1 inauguration, 12 inauguration. We are racing for these columns. I think I'm going to go 1, give up on that show space, and uh, inauguration, which means I've got another bonus coming whenever I want to use it. Marty is going to put it up here, so not waste a show and uh, not incur that debt, and he's got an inauguration space as well. Got to go for the one when it comes out, haven't you? Uh, what have we got here? 13, oh dear, I'm taking them from the wrong piles. 13 inauguration, 12 limo, 13 show. Oh, I feel like, I don't know what Marty's going to do. He's, he should have moved these along a bit, I think. I'm definitely going to go for, I do want to do... 12 limo, I think. I could put 12 limo there, but I'm going to go 13 show because it's right here and keeps my odd series. I do need a crane there, but uh, nine points there for shows. Marty can go for 13 show up here and uh, keep going because he does want to work the way down there. He's got 11 points for his shows, and if he gets an 11, that's two series of uh, four odd numbers. Okay, next up, we've got... Nine crane, five inauguration, three improvement. I'm going to go for nine crane. Where would I like the crane to be? If another, like a, if the three coming out would be great there. Maybe not for these odd numbers. I want that crane doing so I could put an 11 there. But I think 
this crane, I could maybe be the first to complete this column. Although Morty's in a very similar position, isn't he? He could, in fact, just do it now. If he wants to give up his show bonus, yeah, he's going to put in a three there, not get the show. He does get an improvement. Gonna, He's going to go for hotels are worth more. So now he's finished this avenue. He circles this hotel. He is going to get the full points for this. Everyone else has to cross off the top part of the First Avenue Hotel. When they complete the column, they will just get the half, which isn't worth as much points. But you can uh, improve how much the half is worth, the same as the full. Okay then. So I'm losing the race for that, although I've got one in the last column. It's not all bad. Got four limo, seven improvements, seven inauguration. Ooh, I can give up a show here. Do I want inauguration or improvement? I'm gonna go... Yeah, I'm going to improve my fountains. I've already found two. Under construction casinos don't get in the way of series. So that is 7, 9, 13, 15. Oh, no, that's not consecutive, is it? I need the 11 to finish that off. Oh, okay. I'm not as clever as I thought. <laughs> I was like, oh, that doesn't stop the series. Oh, yeah, it does, because there's a number missing. Ah, oh, okay, then. What's Marty going to do? <laughs> Something sensible, I hope. He could have four in limo, but although he hasn't done limos at all. He has got a bonus, so he could change the number. Like, he could make this a three, but it would be with limo, so he doesn't really want that. He could just do a little limo run, a safer one. Go four, and just straight out with the limo. He could get to a couple of VIP spaces. Another one down there, maybe? Who knows? Next up, we have three improvements. Three limo, seven limo, eight improvements. So I can go for three here, and that's a massive... Odd series. I need a crane, don't I, and build that. Or I could put the three there. But then three to seven in all these spaces. Whereas this would continue the run if I never build that casino. Yeah, I'm going to do three there. And then limo. Let's just keep going. Marty. Oh, he can do it. And he can do a golf course as well. It's not got a show on it. But he can do that golf course. And limo. He'll just keep going for his little limo ride around here. Because you do want to get it back. And he has done 3, 5, 7, 9, 5, 7, 9, 11. Two series of odd numbers. He gets the nine points for the purple project. Oh, they're, they're in the wrong order, aren't they? There we go. And I don't. <laughs> I can still get some points if I do that later. Uh, so next up, we have one show, four crane, three inauguration. One show here wouldn't be the worst thing. Oh, with another bonus, though, it would be great. I'm going to go for... Four Crane. Marty. Yeah, he's, he's going to keep going for shows. One show. 16 points for his shows right now. Next up, what have we got? Eight improvements. Three Crane, five improvements. I could keep making a big series here. Five and improvements. Yeah. It's just filling these spaces up. It's going to be... I'm going to have to duplicate something. Although, if I never construct these, they're not going to be empty spaces. Uh, I'm going to keep improving the fountains. Marty. Could do a similar thing. And just put the three there. Keep a series going. And he does want to build everything, doesn't he? He's going to... Where does he want to do under the crane? He's going to do it here. He can still get this uh, golf course. Next up, we have 14 improvements. 5 crane, 11 crane. Okay, straight away. It's going to mess up an even thing over here, but I'm going to do 14 and improvement. Oh, I haven't done it yet because I still need to do this. I haven't put anything there still. Oh. So I've done this. So Marty... Uh, yeah, there's no way Marty can get that. Hasn't put anything in there yet. And I don't have that debt anymore. And I get to improve something. Let's just do fountains one more time. Marty does want to stay in this race. He's going to put it over here. So yeah, this is 11 already. I've got to fill four spaces up. Who doesn't have to? Okay, 14. And an improvement. He's going to... Yeah, he's going to keep going with the majorities for the streets, he thinks. Okay, next up we have 8 limo, 8 improvements, 10 show. 
I'm going to go for eight limo. So if I keep the limo going around here, I'll get the cash. Cash. Am I really going to try and go for fountains? So I get, yeah, I'm going to cut in here just to the next lamppost you get to, and then we'll go around here. Yeah, I've got to do two getting. Oh, well, I'll get the VIP for going in front of this one. Yeah, I'll do that. Marty is going to go 10 show. There we go. That's one of the debts cancelled out and 21 points for those shows. Next up, we have nine improvements, 10 crane, 15 inauguration. 15. Yeah, Marty, Marty's going to get that uh, project as well. Let's just uh, pencil that right in. Inauguration, 15. He's got both of, uh, of these hotels. It doesn't matter if you got the, the big or the small. Uh, so he's going to get the first points for that too. So what do I want? Ten and a crane. I go for a 15 and then maybe put a 13 there later at some point. Yeah, that wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, I'm going to go for that. Next we have six limo, nine crane, 14 improvements. I'm going to go for six limo. Oh yeah, I need to be circling my golf courses. And the limo is going to go in there. It's going to come down here later. Yeah, that will be okay. Oh, I should have. Oh yeah, if I, if I go that way, I'm going to have to come back in for this. Yeah, I should have done that the other way. Oh, unfortunately, I've got a marker pen and <laughs> not pencil. Uh, so yes, has, has Marty picked his? I don't think he has. Six, nine, fourteen. He's going to go for another bonus and another improvement. He's going to do 12, though, instead of 14, keeping his uh, series up. So we've got one crane, nine show, 13 show. I'm going to go for... Oh, do I want to go for nine show, though? Change it to a 10 if I really wanted to for those bonuses. Just thinking of all my golf courses. Yeah, actually. I'm going to change it to a 10. Get the par. It's a show. So I get some more points there. And I'm keeping my golf courses going. Marty. 1, 9, 13. 13 show. Would fit there. But yeah, this, <laughs> this odd series is going to have to be broken up. Uh, so he, he does... Get rid of his debts, and he's got 28 points. He could keep going with more shows as well for the other column, too. Uh, so we've got six, nine... Oh, I haven't done that one, have I? Nine, twelve, seven. Show, inaug, show. Six wouldn't be terrible for me here. Although 12 would be... Oh, if 12 was a show, that would be brilliant. I could keep it going up here, 12 and inauguration. Yeah, because I'd get the golf course. And another bonus. Marty's going to go for, I think, yeah, 12 and inauguration there. Okay, next up, we have show, improvement, show. When a 15's out, we've kind of done. <laughs> I'd like a crane there and do that as 15. But nine and six for shows, where could they go? Six. Yeah, I'm kind of running out of places for these numbers in the middle. I could go there and just give up the show bonus or change it to something I do want. Yeah, I'm going to change it to a limo because this limo hasn't moved for a little bit. Have we got all of the bonuses? It's the bonuses you drive in front of, by the way. Uh, so yeah, Marty should have this VIP one circled and nothing else. Marty, what does he want? He hasn't done this crane, so the 15 could go there. And an improvement. This is all kind of empty. He's just going to go 15 and an improvement he will... Oh, wait a minute. We aren't doing even uh, hotels. When did this happen? Hotel 6, Hotel 7, I have done completely intentionally. So Marty can't have uh, those. So maybe he'll boost his... Uh... Yeah, he's already boosted this thinking he was going for the big ones. He'll boost the little ones as well. Next up, we have 8 and an improvement. Five in an inauguration, six in an improvement. I don't have a bonus. If you can write a number in, you need to. 
So it would be five there. It would keep the sh it would cross a show out, but it would keep my uh, golf courses going. Yeah, otherwise, yeah, I can't put the numbers anywhere. So it's going to have to be five there, cross out that. But now the fountain kicks in because there's a number there. Uh, and I get an inauguration. Marty, left more gaps to be playing with, is going to go for, although not too many. He's going to go for six and an improvement. He will... Yeah, he thinks he's going to have the most. He wants more points for having these left over at the end. Limo, show, two limo, 11 show, 11 inauguration. I feel like I need to go for two. Two, no show bonus. But we keep the limo trucking back. Two, 11, 11, 11 is perfect for up here. It's not got a show on it, so we'll have an inauguration. We have 11 crane, 10 limo, 6 inauguration. Oh, I want an 11 there, don't I? 11. Just noticed that. And a crane somewhere else. Do I want a crane? I don't particularly want a crane there because it's keeping my series going. Maybe I want one here because this is the par 5 golf course that is worth uh, 3 points. Maybe more if I boost it. Well, I probably won't boost them. Marty hasn't had one of these, has he? Let's see the 11 and 10. 10 somewhere down here. I think 10 limo. 10 might work there. He just wants to come back, I think. But he just get that VIP. And we have Crane 7. We have Calc 4. We have limo 6. I'm going to go for Improvement 4. Let's see, I've got all of my three golf courses. I can make them all worth a point extra each. Oh, I have at some point done this. It doesn't really uh, matter who did that first, does it? Because I'm miles away. I have got three of these hotels. I could make each of those worth an extra point, and maybe I'll do more over the course of the game. But it's doubtful, because if I'm not doing cranes, it's less likely I will. Like, what if my limo doesn't get back? I could make the penalty less. It's 10 points for every action you would have needed, basically, step to get back. At the moment, that's one, two, three. It would cost me 30 points. I'm going to try and shrink the penalty down there a bit. So Marty746. Go for just a four somewhere over here. Well, he does want a crane. What if he went for seven there? And a crane. Where would he want a crane? Up there for a really big number, but it doesn't really make... If he wants all the cranes, though, for that project, yeah, you just got to build them all. So next up, 14 inauguration, 12 improvements, 2 improvements. I think I am definitely going to do 2 improvements. I could have waited for that. A one or a three could have gone there. It's, I thought I was making a series, but I've interrupted it with this five. Uh, so two and an improvement. Let's uh, really try and shrink that penalty down because we, we might just be able to keep weaving around and not bother going back. You can't fork off or anything like that. Uh, so 12. Mm, if it had a show in it, that would definitely be tempting there. A two. Two could just go there. Although he hasn't driven past there to make it... Worth bothering with. A two can go here though and give him a golf course. Uh, so I need to just reshuffle the piles now. We know what the bonuses are going to be. Okay, so nine improvement, 14 crane, 10 inauguration. 14 show would be brilliant, but I don't have a bonus. I can't put nine anywhere. I can't put 10 anywhere. So I need to put a 14 down. So there keeps my golf courses going. I probably won't do that. Uh, it's not going to show in it, unfortunately, but I do get to do a crane. I could get a crane there, but only a 15 will work. No one's done the extended casino bonus yet. So if we do this, maybe we'll get a 13 in there and keep this, make this series a bit bigger. Marty hasn't got that crane's cup for 14 in, hasn't got that crane. It's going to have to be a 9 there, isn't it? Can't put a 9, could, could put a nine in there, but would prefer an 8. 
and <laughs> doesn't really want to spend these because he wants it to have the most, he'll change it to an eight. What does he want to change to an eight? Inauguration, yeah. He'll do inauguration eight, because that gives him another one. Maybe a bonus, but maybe a majority as well. I think I already went, didn't I? So we have three show, nine limo, four crane. Not the best for me. I've left such a big gap here. Why would I put that five there? It's to continue this run. I know why I did it. These uh, hard and even series really mess you up. Well, if you do them like I did. So it, it'd have to be... I could put the four there. Would, like, yeah, that, that's a good enough run, isn't it? We just have the four going there. And I can do a crane somewhere. Am I really going to get the 15 there? Maybe. It's a golf course if I do. But <laughs> we're both being quite devil make care with the... Uh, debts. I can't actually remember what Marty did. Not that I ever saw it, of course. Marty, for threes. Threes are okay there, and fours. Nines. There. We could have a nine. He's going to do four. And crane. Got so many cranes left to do, though, still. Two more cranes. So he's done... I haven't done any more columns, not realised ever. He's done this column. So I can't have 4th Avenue anymore, or the big hotel. No, no one else has done any more, which we should probably work on. Uh, next up, 5 improvements, 4 crane, 2 improvements. So 5 is no good for me, nor is 4. So it'd have to be a 2. Oh, I, I want to put a 2 there, because then I get the fountain. And I have done 2nd Avenue. Marty is going to do a five, even though he'd like it to have a show. Maybe he does a four. He can't do a four anyway. He could do... Yeah, two's not got an improvement on it. He doesn't really care about that fountain. Whereas if he does the five here, he doesn't get the show. But that debt's wiped out, and he's done Fifth Avenue. On two. What have we got? Nine limo. Eleven inauguration. Eleven crane. So I only have the option of an 11 here. I don't really want to do a crane, do I? I don't think so. 11 inauguration sounds good to me. Marty. Oh, so I've done uh, 9th Avenue because Marty isn't going to be able to do that because he hasn't built this crane. 9, 11, 11. So 11 can go here somewhere. 9 could go here. Either way, it's getting rid of a show. Unless he uses his bonus to make it a show. Or he could use his... <laughs> he shouldn't be using his bonus. He's going to be using his bonus to make that a 12 to try and uh, get the streak majority. Although he's messed, he's interrupted it there. Uh, next we have 6 inauguration, 8 improvements, 9 limo. Oh, that's bad for me, isn't it? Yeah, I can't... I have got a bonus. I could use the bonus. No, I think I'm going to hang on. If you can't put anything down, you just get two... Space is crossed off on your inauguration track. I think that's what I'm going to go for. Marty, 689. Yeah, he can put a 6 in right there. Or a 9 there. Oh, an 8 would keep this streak going. It's not got show on it, unfortunately. But he can do another improvement to maybe... He's got three hotels. I should have improved hotels. Look at that. So he's done this one now. If someone is focusing on cranes, he seems to have a lot of cranes empty. So improve something. His limo isn't back, is it? Maybe he wants to cut down on that penalty. So one show, two improvements, five limo. Hey, numbers that I can do something with. Okay, so I think one show is a bit of a waste. But I can't put fives in, so one, don't get anything from show unless I want to use one of these. Yeah, I'll, I'll change it to limo. Because I can go past another fountain and get a little bit closer to going back to the start. So I'm only one, two spaces away. And I lose three points for each, which isn't a great deal. Marty can do five limo. Get this hotel. And yeah, he gets a ten point penalty, doesn't he? He's, he's just going to bring his, uh, his back, I think. We've got 11 improvements, 9 limo, 7. Oh, that sounds bad for me. If I get two crosses, unless I want to maybe duplicate a casino. 
We'll change the number. Yeah, I'm going to change the number. Because I could make this 13. Crazy streak on the bottom there. Marcy's not getting that. And I've done 8th Avenue. Which Marty cannot do. No, he hasn't even done this crane. Cross that off for this round. 1197. What can he do? With no bonuses, absolutely nothing. Gets two inauguration marks, which he's in the lead again for that. But this is uh, winding to the end now. Nine show, seven improvements, 11 limo. Sounds bad for me. I can't put anything down. I haven't got any bonuses. Game ends either when we're all full up or somebody's full up on the inauguration track, which next time I can't fill something in. Marty 9711. He's going to make this a six. So he gets this bonus and he gets this avenue done. Then we have 814.4. I can use a four. I can't use a 14. No, I can't use a four. There's a four there. I can use, oh, there's a crane there. And this bonus needs three in there. This is the last turn. Yeah, you need three spaces to fill in to get that bonus. So I didn't have one to use. And you can't use a bonus if you didn't do anything. So that's that, I'm afraid. 8.14.4. Marty doesn't have any um, bonuses either that he can use. And he can't fill anything in there either. So he, he's lost the inauguration track, though. So it's down to... The scoring of projects, I I did do these in the end, didn't I? Yeah, I was last for them. Nobody got all of the cranes, which is a big uh, undertaking, really. So once he gets 18 for those, I get 9. Inauguration, I didn't upgrade it, but I do have the most left over, 4 to 2. So I get 10 points. Marty, although it's a two-player game, <laughs> he, uh, yeah, he, he's got less left over. He's second place, uh, so he gets 8 but because he's got uh, the least, he, he gets eight, by the way, because he upgraded it. That's why it's not much of a difference. I didn't upgrade it. Uh, because he's got the fewest, though, he gets a debt. Marty gets 28 and zero from his shows. I, oh, I did cross off those debts. I get zero and 12. For hotels, Marty gets four for every big hotel. So that's four, eight, 16 points. And two for every small one. Two, four, six. Checking if I've missed any off. I don't think I have. Hotels for me. I only get three, but I've got three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen. I should have upgraded those. And a point for every small one. Yeah, it's more likely I got less because I didn't do uh, cranes. So now you, your runs of biggest, odd, or even. So my big one on here is one, two, three, four, five. A point for each casino in your big run, basically. Uh, five, seven, nine, 11, 13, 15. So that's uh, six on that street. Two, four. Remember, if it's not built, it doesn't interrupt your series. Two, four, six, eight, ten. That's another five there. I've done really well. One, three, five, seven, nine, 11, 13, 15. Wow. So that is eight on that bottom one. Will Marty even get any majorities on this? So he's got 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13. So yes. Then a gap there. So 3, 5, 7, 9, 11. That's 5. Then, oh, here what's going on. 8, 10, 12, 14. Down here, 6, 8, 10, 12. So after all of that, he gets the majority on 1. I get the majority on the other three. We don't even tie. So he gets times one. That's 10. I only get four, but it's times three. So that's 12. And then the points for each, I'll get more on. So he's got 11, 15, 19. I got 24. Golf courses. Marty got a three and two fours. So that's uh, one point for each three, two points for each four, and nothing for those. I got all three threes, but they're still worth uh, a point. I got four fours and one of the fives. So that's going to be three, eight, three. Then your limo <laughs> journey. Okay, Marcy didn't get back, did it? He got two VIPs and there are numbers in them. 
So he gets uh, six points for those, but he didn't quite get back. He's going to lose six points. Just one step he didn't get back. I went to a lot more things, and I, I reduced the penalty, though. So I've got... Just check they've got numbers in here. Yes. Two, three, four, five fountains. Did I go past any VIP things? Not that I circled. Oh, yeah, one there. So that's worth three points. Seven times five. They, yeah, I've, uh, <laughs> I think I've done okay on the here. And uh, one, two spaces away, but they're only three point penalty each. So that is six points. Now, the money. First of all, we reveal what we chose. So I chose to be generous and take ice alone. Marty didn't. So half or more chose to be frugal. So we each get two bundles of cash. Everybody gets the same. It's just what the majority picked effect. If, if Marty had chosen loan, and so the majority chose loan, we would get four each. And if both of us had picked stingy, we would still get two each. So added to that is any bundles of cash you drove past from the mob. One, two, I believe I've got. And you start the game with one as well. Marty, I don't think, drove past any. So now we look at the debts that you've got left over. So anything that you basically circled. None of us used the duplicate casinos bonus, actually. But any casinos you built, if you, if you put a number in them, if you constructed the casino, you don't get the debt anymore. So I built one crane that didn't get filled in. Yeah, I think I've been very, very safe, actually. So uh, yeah, one of those is crossed off to account for the debt, but I don't think I've got debt anywhere else. So if you still have bundles of cash left, as long as you didn't go over, basically, if you didn't have more debts than the bundles of cash, you can cross off the 20-point penalty. Otherwise, you take the penalty. So Marty has got one... Yeah, just one crane not filled in. That one shouldn't be showing. One crane not filled in and one there. So even though he's only got three bundles of cash, he's okay there too. So uh, let's work it out then. So yeah, thanks to that uh, fantastic limo ride, I have ended up with 132 to Marty's 110. His limo cancelled out. He didn't lose any points in that, but he did take a couple of bonuses and not really get anywhere. Uh, yeah, if he would have gotten some points if he'd gotten the majority that he improved or if he'd maybe improved his hotels or something a bit more. Well, really, it was it was putting so much improvement into being getting the majorities for the rows and then not really getting those majorities, which I I was trying to do anyway. Uh, but uh, yeah, I wasn't specifically trying to take them away. But anyway, that is just an example game of Welcome to New Las Vegas. If you'd like to know what I think about the game, the link will be on the screen very shortly or it's in the description now. If you'd like to see more playthroughs, there's over 400 on the channel, including plenty of roll and write games like Quinto and Octodice, the original Welcome To. Twa Dice will have either recently gone up or will be going up soon. There's loads to see, but I will see you wherever you end up. And uh, thank you. And I'll see you for the next game. Bye, everyone.